Hi, Soms. Byron. Byron. Come here, sweetie. Hi. Byron, come here. Byron. Hi. Hi. Remember me? Byron. Hey. Come here, sweetie. Byron. Okay. Well, Byron is ready to go under the bed, but she's just outside of it, yeah. just looking at me. When I hold food out in front of him, right. he sort of sniffs for it, and he knows where my fingers are. Oh, there he goes. And he knows where his beds are. I've given him... Yeah, he's not following very well. I didn't really do that. He hasn't, um... He hasn't followed his treats until he can smell them or his chicken and I have to put his bowl of food in front of him enough so that he can smell it. Right. I can't, I'm not getting enough light on his eyes. Do you, do you consider them still having that glassy look? Oh yeah. Yes? They're okay. both, they're both dilated. Um, they've actually... Yeah, they're pretty dilated. I'm going to get a little, I'm going to switch that other light on. Well, now, he just followed your movement. Oh, yeah. There's some vision, but I don't know how much. Mm -hmm. And we have not moved the treats jars this morning, just food. Foggy, <laughs> you're yelling so much. Would you like me to get a stronger light? No, that's good. I treated some of his, um, his lesions. Right. And I see a little blood has started to come out of the really big one. Okay. But it's not anything that has to be done immediately, and I don't want to... It, it doesn't bother him here, it just tickles him. Right. Yeah. But this is one of his new favorite spots, instead of under the bed. Yeah. Which works for us, and he still likes that one, which is great, because I can see him. Hi, Will. What are you doing? Have we done morning kisses yet? Ten? Should we do one more? Do some more? Got lots from England. Mm -hmm. He just lets me do that into perpetuity. It's a good thing. Did I add an extra PE to that? Who cares? Hi. Hi. Can you see me? You did not. I know. Foggy. Foggy. His, um, oh, are you going to do rollies? I can see it coming. He's doing roly polies. That's good. Wait, Foggy. That's good. Yeah. We had a real love in last night. He chose not to go out. Right. Um, I was going to let him go out in the rain if he wanted to, mm -hmm. and we got to the door and he just wasn't showing any interest. Right. I don't know if it's because he had a huge dinner. 
Hi, and I normally um, bring chicken with me, but um, last night was one of the first nights, and then I'm really guessing here, wondering if he just didn't fancy the negotiations with his vision. I, I don't know. Are you ready for long? Are you sleepy? I told him you were coming. So, I guess... Do you need a cushion? Um, I actually think... Or, or it's going to be gonna... better for me just sitting just in the to... chair. Okay, great. I... I am not getting any food out for you, Foggy. You've had a big brecky, just because we do not want to distract Henny Bear. No. Okay. Pixie woo woo. Okay, I made a big mistake. I didn't have record on, and what we're documenting here, that's Pixie. So Pixie... Who hates everybody, <laughs> basically. <laughs> Cats and humans. So last time I was here, <laughs> the other shy cat, Byron, just, just suddenly decided that she was going to be friends with me and wanted my touch, and I gave it to her. And so I left here thinking, all right, Pixie's the last one. And... And we're, we're going to see some changes next week when I come back, and here I am. She just jumped up And she, she what she did, she just, I was talking with Basha, and all of a sudden, there's this cat I hadn't seen before jump up on the desk. And then she jumped up here, and she accepted my hand, and now I'm talking, and I'm within a foot of her, and she's obviously completely... She loves Calm about she it. loves snuggles. She loves them. Absolutely loves them, don't you, sweetheart? Um, good girl. Well, what are you doing? Oh, okay, you're gonna back up there? Go back up there? Yeah. Oh, should I mess things up for long just now? Come here. Yeah. Oh no, she's totally relaxed. She's yeah. in play mode. Yeah. I mean, we still got a little uh, Hi. progress to make here, but this is big. This is big. Hi, I can't believe she let you touch her like that. Well, that one horrified sniff, it, which it always makes me laugh. Come. Yeah, she knows that's me. Put your finger there again. Let's see what she does. Pigs. Oh no, you're good. That was a push. Yeah, yeah that was, that was you're good. good. It was yeah. good. Thank you, Pixie. All right, I got you all of you now. <laughs> um, okay, so. Oops, so uh, Foggy. Foggy. So pump here. And. Kitchen uh, towels here. I've got um, chicken at room temperature ready for Henry for afterwards. Oops, I almost took a double dose here. Harriet is out here too. So, they're sort of all comfortable with me now. I'm not telling Harriet that she was the most popular picture from International Cat State because she'll get big headed. Oh. Really? Well, it was a cute upside down picture. I saw them. I went through them quickly. Okay, we'll, we will return. Harriet is out properly. I bet you any money if you got on your knees and. Oh, she came right up. Yes. Harry? Um, yes. Harry? She probably. Oh, there she goes. She was ready to okay. run under the. We're not offering treats. No, we're not doing it that way. Look, Pixie. It's okay. Good girl. Good girl. Harry. Good girl. Harry, I'm giving this your blessing. 
Now, I mean, I'm giving this my best. Now, isn't this interesting? So, yeah. Byron was near the bed ready to go under it before, and I, I tried to encourage her over, but she, she didn't take it. So, I don't know where she is now. Um, but yet, Byron. these two now are all of a sudden coming up to me. Part of it is Byron, um, Byron's territory for uh, snuggling is the couch, she, and she may have been slightly reacting to you on the couch, and that's a, one of her real little safe spots. Okay. Uh, so okay. Okay. We can try that again. You mean from last week when I yeah. was? Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Right. Well, I mean, look, Pixie's just totally. Hi. Relaxed. She's totally oh yeah, she's she wants to. And you know, Harriet a little bit, but still, yeah, still a little cautious. Hey, Henry, we haven't forgotten about you. We're just, Henry. we're just catering to everybody. Love you. All right, so I'll be right back, okay? And I don't know how much he can see. So. When we, when I cut off the video just before, I walked to the front of the apartment and, and the two shy kitties scattered. But now, that's Pixie up there, right? It will be. She... No, she's up there. Yeah. So she came right back. Oh, she did. She yeah, came, she's comfortable. She came right back. She's comfortable. And, and there's Holmes. So, uh, I love his position, too. He's really oh, happy. Oh, that's his favorite thing, his paws yeah. over. So, Normally on top of the fridge. And Foggy... And Foggy is... Foggy uh, is going to be... <laughs> 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 as long as it's softer than what I'm wearing. So, the blanket or a sweater. Yeah. And she's going to snuggle up. Oh, here comes Sons. Oh. So this hasn't been occupied since Henry wasn't able to curl up into a small ball comfortably. Oh. That was on its way out the house. Right. And then Henry jumped on it and said, oh, no, no, I was using this. Of course. And, and then I couldn't get rid of it. Of course. So, okay, are you going to settle down? Good girl. All right. Good so girl. here we go. He's got a really sleepy look about him, which is cute. And I don't know what's going on with his eyes. They look better than, they look less glassy than they did this morning. They are, uh, yeah, I was going to say that maybe a touch of glassiness, but nothing where I'd say, oh, And his, his pupils are, really... are dilated, but not as dilated as this morning. So the big difference is um, a nice new collection of pretty gnarly lesions. Yeah, where? Um, on the back of the neck. Oh. Which? These weren't there before. Well, this one was. Uh, yeah, but it hadn't got oh. so ugly. Right. Right. To the point where um, the doc had to shave it and clean it. Right. What are you doing, Hen? Okay, he's licking his spots. Is that bothering you? Ah. Okay, I'm gonna try one thing. To go in there. That was 
one of his little hidey spots, but he hasn't been in that since the lesions. Uh, don't do that, Henry. Henry, you want to come back up here? Hen Hen, do you want to come back up? Hen Hen? Yeah, oh wow, he can get right at it. He can so get them, yeah. Except for his neck. But. I know. How about we go back up here? That's long. You want to come back up here? There, yeah. there we go. Oh, no. I'm just glad that he's quit sleeping under the bed. <laughs> and here's your very competent, agile former marathon runner mom <laughs> and you've got the chair behind you to work with yes great so it's still recording i'm just gonna great honey should we talk about the books behind you that we've got jason williamson's grammar wanker behind you <laughs> <laughs> and many, many biographies of Lord Byron, of course. There we go. Are you happy there? He has never worked at his lesions so much before, has he? Um, the first day I was here, I, I think he did. The, um, the one on the eye looks smaller. Yeah, it's gone down. I've been using the same um, drops gently on that lesion that I put in the left eye, which was the most affected. Right. And it has it has shrunk, yeah. Uh, that's okay. You can, you can use my hand for power. It's okay. See, he looked at me like that this morning and I wondered what he could see. He's staring right at me. Mm hmm.
some so much of his behavior is completely normal the eating right. the waiting for the food mm -hmm. grooming not this kind of right. lesion grooming but the washing of the paws and the face right That one, one under his It's better. His mouth is much better too. Yeah, I've been treating that one too. The way he just looked up at you. I know. That's <laughs> what I got with this morning with accompanying pearls. It was it was nice. He didn't want to snuggle or get under the duvet like he used to do, but still. Mm-hmm. When I get up, he doesn't register me visually. Yeah. Can I turn around? Let me see ya. Just gonna lie down here. You did before? Yeah? Yes, you are. Good boy. Well, thank you for showing us your... <laughs> your wool wounds. He looks so much <clears throat> different. <clears throat> oh, bless him. Yeah. yeah, that one's... That one was okay until that really red bit came in this morning but oh just this morning yeah it was i i treated it with powder last night right and and then it was pinker this morning right. okay you get comfy you get comfy yeah. he just made a move to go down mm -hmm. you did didn't you yeah you gonna stay i'm in i'm inclined to let him do what he needs what he to, wants do. to do. Sure. Um, mm -hmm. Because we can go back and try again. Yeah. Okay. Good boy. So, the first couple of times he stood right with me yesterday and today, it's like, okay, I'll take some now. We'll yeah. Do some later. Um, yeah, it's. That was interesting how he he let you split it up last time. And. And the, the treats, like if we didn't do the treats, I don't know if it, if it would have turned out differently. Yeah. But, um, 
but no so treat. Now we've eliminated that, and uh, so we're getting the real deal now. So, um, okay. well, it looks like we're not giving up yet. No. And even before he got sick, he used to lie there with his chin resting on the water bowl, just because he liked it, and I always associated with that with a cat being sick. But that's just one of his favorite spots, right? That was on my chair, but who cares? Oh, I know. Wait. Oh my goodness me. You were so quiet when all of that was going on. Good. She's going through flopsy and affection. Yeah. Good girl. Wait, this is the second time you've touched it or the first? Today's the first. Oh, Jesus. So. This is Rapid transformation, but just like Byron last week. Pretty unbelievable. I, I normally have to be there to say it's okay. And, and she, she figured it out on her own. She, yeah, I don't have to be anywhere near her. Good girl. I, I can hear the vibrate, I feel the vibration, I can't hear the purr. Oh, she's such a loud purr, when she really? going. Really? Well, she's, she, her body's vibrating, so I know she's purring, but she, uh, but I just don't hear it. You're absolutely right, I can feel it. Oh, Henry's coming in. Um, hey, Henry. I didn't underfeed him on purpose, he's just got... A ginormous appetite. So, um, Henry, do you want to go to the front? Let's do that, Hen. Should we do that? Um, Pixie's got a, a history of some, um, breathing apparatus issues. You can hear That's it. That's what I just heard yeah. that, yeah. It, it flares up. We treat it and then it goes away, or it flares up, has its moment, and goes away on its own. So I've sort of learnt to figure out when I need to take her in to see right. the dark. She's very happy right now. What do you think, Henry? Yeah. Do you want 
See, and in, and in this light, his eyes look better than they did out there. So. Interesting. His wound is looking pretty dramatic. Oh, you are so handsome. Help him up there. Yeah. There we go. There we go. You know where you are. Oh my goodness, yes. Doing exactly what. Dr. Ashley did not want you to do, but we'll take what we can. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and just ignore them, Henry. Um. Uh, what's the word? Not indecisive. Well, I, I was going to say restless. Restless. Yeah. There um. you go. Hen -hen. So Henry has uh, seemed to be feeling restless, but Basha suggested that he still wants some more food because he has a huge appetite, which is a really good thing. But he may be waiting for he is. some He's, more food. Um, Hen. Okay, let's put so the we're in. we're going to relent and give Hen. some food. Look at that. Not you, Foggy. Not, Not you, Foggy. You. He knows it's coming. Look at his... There's a certain... I know I'm about to get a look in his eyes. Yep. You're so funny there. I <laughs> yeah, what? Oh, but there's food now too. He's yeah. Like, oh great! I'm uh, so excited. Yeah. Now we're gonna close this up, sweetheart. We <laughs> do have loads. Henry. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Oh, 
and oh, he really needed that. You are eating like you did not have a gigantic breakfast. Look at him go. And then I look. I use that juice, the jelly that forms when I cook the right. thighs. I'm speaking as a vegan. Caveat. Um, and then my backup for him is this, which makes him come in when I need him when he's in the garden. Is that turkey? Uh, it's either turkey, yeah, it's uh, turkey or chicken from the same company. Uh, we try and get organic. Uh -huh. It's funny, when I'm cooking the cheap stuff, it looks yellow from too much corn. It's so disgusting. Uh -huh. Okay, is that going to do it for you? I can't finish this because we're getting more of this today. Okay, there's, there's five of us here <laughs> in a relatively small space. Um, Everyone except Byron. Byron and Byron is uh, chickens. Byron, chickens. Chickens? I don't know where she is. She's the one that's crazy for, for this stuff. Actually, she's the one that I used to buy this for because she re refused to eat cat food. Wow. So I just used to put this with supplements on it, I know, but she changed her mind okay. because it's her privilege. Look at him go. What's the word I'm looking for? Prerogative. He will finish this whole thing. All right, I'm going to give you half more, and you're practically <coughs> taking my fingers off. You <laughs> really... I know. Okay, so you were hungry. Oh, look. And here we are. Here we are. All of us. Alon, do you want to give her your first chicken? Uh, she doesn't understand palms. Oh. Like we do tips of fingers got it. in this house. It's just the way we got used to it. She'll take it from you. Very gentle. Nice. And it's so cute if you accidentally put your hand in her mouth, you feel that she's got no teeth and it's the cutest feeling. Oh, she's the one with no teeth, mm -hmm. right? Yes, no, I, I knew that from Dillard. He got all his teeth out at two years old. Yeah, same here. Yeah. That was Dr. Colangelo's great discovery. Wait. So we got Byron. We've got Foggy. Pixie. Harriet. Pixie behind you. Pixie. And Mr. I'm going to be Henry wasted. And... Sonsy. Sonsy. All of us here together. This is a first. We're having a, a chicken... Uh, here. If you... Um, uh, Harry, would you like to have some chicken from Lan? See if she will take it from you. She probably will at this point if you stay there and reach out to her. Yeah, she will. Good there you girl. Go. Very gentle. That was that was really sweet. Henry, you have something to learn from your sisters here. <laughs> he has always been such a hooligan when it comes to accepting food. Do you really need to see this finished off? No, she's crying. Pixie is the only one that doesn't care for this for some reason. She's interested though. I know. She only likes it when it's freshly cooked. Or she might... Oh, there, there, there you go, proving me wrong. Just to mess with us. Well, you know, she's just changed her ways today, so might as well... <laughs> might as well cover all bases. Why right? don't you... Oops! <laughs> Somebody will pick that up. Here, Lon, why don't you give her a little bit? Uh, fingers only. Oh, yeah, she's like, I don't... I know you. It's fine. I got this. I might as well finish this because I'm cooking there's some uh, a couple of uh, there's a packet in the fridge defrosting right so we're not gonna go without today hen <coughs> uh, 
When I hear her little chirping bird noises, it kills me. Ow, ow! I, you just nearly took a finger off. Let me see your sight. Let me see your sight. See, did you see that? I did not. Look. Okay, let's put the packet away. Did he follow you? Or? Mm -mm. He did not. He can smell it. Yeah. He, oh, did you, did see, you see that? that? Yeah, I did see that. I did see that. Wow. Okay. And, and also, he knows it's here. Okay, yeah, there you go. But you saw that little... Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. That was enough to tell you that... Yeah, there's something he, up. He doesn't yeah. have full, full vision. Right. But he's managing great, yeah. as... Of course. I know they do. Yeah. And um, nothing is going to change in the house, so he doesn't have to negotiate his way around anything new. Exactly. Here you go, sweetheart. Yeah, could be and fun. sometimes he walks away from his bowl, leaving a little bit in, which he never would have done before. Okay. Um, I just sort of... Here you go, baby. Let's see. All done. Is your tummy happy now? Oh, Pixie. Pixie, you're a new cat. Oh my gosh, look at the state yeah. of her. Oh, I see. Oh no. I forgot you, Sonsy. Oh, what a cool. And, and he's been there very patient this I whole know, time. I normally, well, you say that wrong, but norm he sneaks when she eats, uh, Foggy eats on here. He sneaks in behind her when I'm there because I can't see him mm -hmm. and he steals her food. Uh -huh. He's so naughty. <laughs> but all I do is laugh because he never eats too much and she gets what she needs. So what I've got now is um, the leftover jelly juice which I'll pour on top of their regular food tonight. Right. And your long-suffering servant is going to cook chicken for you guys. Henry, what do you feel about that? to put hers away, as I mentioned, in her drawer so that I bring it out as many times as she needs until she's finished it, but I have to protect her. Yeah. And also, sometimes she won't eat when uh, there's too much commotion. Uh-huh. Good boy, honey. But we're, we're all happy. Good girl, Pixie. You've made a new friend. Oh, she's making biscuits. Good girl. Mm, okay. Good girl. Yeah. You're pretty comfortable, aren't you? Wow, look at that. Yeah. I'm oh, sure. look at this. Oh my goodness. I do this with. I. I saw you do that with Byron last week. That was really interesting. Yeah. And I, I do this with uh, with all my cats. I've done it. Okay. I just make a fist, I and if they're if they're so inclined, they'll just massage themselves on the knuckles. I tried that with Byron, and she did it. Do you want to see something really hilarious with with Pixie? I'm a dry food, um, hardcore no person. Yeah. Unless it's an, a little treat. Right. But she goes bonkers. But watch the. This is this is almost like going back to her time when I rescued her from under the Brooklyn Bridge. Look, watch, watch how much. <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> <laughs> Just in case there's a yeah. a pride of marauding lions next to her, and she hasn't even finished what she's <laughs> so, got there. <laughs> well, yeah, stuck up. 
Do you want to stuff up? Yeah, there you go. Look, it's falling out of her. <laughs> it's falling out of her mouth. Here, have a candy. Sure, I'll have some. It's hilarious. <laughs> I let her get away with it a couple of times a week because it just makes me hoot. And, um, the only thing dry Heidi gets is uh, uh, Greenies treats. Right. Which I use also as uh, influence to get her to yeah you know eat her lysine chew which sometimes she's a little reluctant yeah or whatever i thought i when she started doing that i i think it was just because her relationship with henry has always been so fraught yeah he would completely torment her away from anything I don't know. Oh, and when she wouldn't show up, I wouldn't. I think I told you this. Um, it was because he was ambushing her, so that she couldn't come here to eat. He's so naughty. Henry. Henry is so naughty. And no one else grooms, uh, gives himself pedicures like he does. He really, really works at his claws. No one else does this, like really pulls at them, uh -huh. takes the sheaths off. Uh -huh. What a good boy! Did you like that? Was it worth the wait? Yeah? What do you think? Where are we at, Where are we at in the day now, hmm? What do you think, Boo? Yeah? Okay. When you use the grave, um, the dry food in front of you. Do you know it's there? Boo boo. I'm gonna make sure we don't mix the meds into the food. Can you come forward a bit? Come sweetheart. Oh, that's a good boy. Okay, let's get this. Let's get these raw ones. There. This one. Where was the other one that he's been really barbering at? This one. And... There's a little red bit right on the tip of this one that we're calling the new subcontinent. There, we're not going to do the really dry part of the scab, just the new yeah. slightly reddened ones. Um, so you just, and you just leave it on there? Just leave it on there and it, it dries it up and he doesn't lick it and I'm okay. I'm wondering I thought I covered everything today oh here's one I might as well while I'm here yeah. I'm gonna do that <clears throat> this one's got bigger this one has got powder on from this morning so I did that one I think I may have missed this one this right. morning, okay. and this is the one he's been yeah. working out. I try not to touch it, but I just move the powder there. Yeah, there's a little uh, mound of it. Yeah, and I think I've got everything, because nothing else is, is coming up raw. Okay. okay, I think I've got all of the spots now. And I'm really happy that it doesn't bother him. Yeah. He just lets me. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Man. He's like, I don't care. I've got a tummy full of food. I'm good. Good boy. You're so brave. Can you smell that? So those aren't so no, good. he's yeah. not. He's not interested. He, he just wants the good stuff. Chicken, yeah. Oh, hang on. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. Good stuff. oh, he knows his way down. I've been trying to keep my papers off there. Good boy. Yeah, see, he's taking the slow way down. Normally he would have just leapt off here. But he knew where to go. He did. He totally knew I mean, where to go. I mean, he looked, appeared like he could see where he was going. Yeah. What do you think, Henry? Do you want any more? Going back to the front. Harriet's 
Where are you going? Oh, is he going under the bed? Oh, he's going under his hidey spot. Okay. That's it for him. So, okay. Yeah. All right. So, and we've uh, never had to drag him out of there. He's always come out of his own accord. Right, board. exactly. Yeah. He's had enough for today. Yeah. And he had food and we had a little bit. Right. It's interesting what he what he will accept and what he don't. And you know what? That first couple of times, it was almost, even though he's declined, it's almost like his need was so great. It's like the first time you've, you're being massage like if you haven't had it forever it feels like such a relief right Samzy he knows he knows that there's a slim chance you might let him out that door look at you big dude this but I think maybe I should at least give him something so oh well he would love that yeah. he's just a big dude because um beautiful Kind of Look at her. Did you see that? Yeah, I did. Whoa. Hey. We Tokyo Olympics missed that. Henry. I mean, so easy. Oh my god. Did he just give you. Yeah. I haven't got my glasses on. Yeah, he did. He just give you, gave you a little face rub? Yeah. He's like, oh. A face mask rub. Hey, come here. He's like, damn, this is going to be great. Samsy. Hey, come here. Samsy? Come. 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 Samsy. Good boy. There we go. Good boy. Ah, oh, there's a good boy. You are also a big boy. <laughs> I love you. <coughs> Another first at Cat Towers. To anyone watching this who's always said, oh, cats don't want to get massaged. <laughs> They're too independent. And as Soamsy's 
servant, I will say that he is not a snuggler. He will allow a headbutt here and there, and then he's off. I've got a few good headbutts there. She was nice. You totally <coughs> were showered in them. When I was here last week, he let me do a few things on him, but nothing like this. He didn't respond like this. Mm -mm. Foggy got the bulk of the work last time. <laughs> oh, look. Are you relaxed, Foggy? She's getting it from the sun right now. She, poor substitute for you, she's probably thinking. I'll, I'll come over with you, Foggy. But Soames is pretty occupied right this now. This is great. It's... It's so endearing the way he keeps looking up at you. I know, I know. I love it. And, and with eyes that are totally approving. Oh, yeah. Oh. Is that it? Is that it? Is, is that your limit, Samsy Pops? Samsy. Do you just want to move? This one. Okay. Oh, okay. okay. That was a please continue look. Yeah. Unless I'm very much mistaken. I'm trying not to get too near the door because then he'll think it's time garden time. brought something out of him. I've never seen this. Did you see that? Yeah. He's, he's love biting me. Yeah. What are you doing? He looked at me first, then I got several, several love bites. Are you happy, boy? Was that nice? I'm, I'm, I'm afraid he's getting maybe just a little bit overstimulated. Stimulated, yeah, yeah. So, um, and he's not used to this. No. So, what we did in the last five minutes or so is definitely a step up from what we did the, the five minutes we had sure. last week. So, we can just add on to that. Yeah. She, that was that was cute. That was really adorable. She's ready for the long haul. <laughs> Foggy. You're going to be more than five minutes. You are so funny. Do we have more than five minutes? Yeah. I... I have the afternoon clear for domestic duties. You know, you know. You know what's coming, right? And you're right. She completely turned her yelling down to zero when you started on... Everybody. Yeah. Pixie, Henry. She just stops. I didn't even have to do anything. Pardon the wobbling. Foggy, your impersonation of a tragic 1920s film, silent film, 
It's ridiculous. her paws? Oh, I love playing with her paws. Oh, okay, yeah, she obviously likes it. I, I love putting my finger in the middle of her paw I pad. I love that. I yeah. absolutely I love, that. love it. Yep. I'm trying to think of one of them that doesn't like it. I think they all let me do it, even Pixie. It's the thing I tell clients or people I run into who say that their cats just don't want to have their nails trimmed. And they just say, massage their paws. Uh-huh. And if you're getting a new cat, start early. Oh, yeah. Just because the main thing is, is you just want them comfortable and enjoying having their paws rubbed, and then it's not such a big deal when you go to, to trim the nails. Yeah, I can do four of them, and even if it's not all of them, we'll just carry on the next day and get them done. Yeah. Yeah. Upside down, almost. Again, it's been so different to all the other visits. Every time. Every time. It yep. be different next time. Mm hmm. There we go. I'm sorry there's such an ugly car behind you. I wish it was a vintage Aston Martin, but <laughs> can't have everything. Good girl, Fogs. Thank you, Lon, so much. Wow, that was my head is so full of the last hour and a bit's events. I mean, I think you know my my working on the other cats. Well, he's he's guarding us. Don't worry. Is we're safe. It, it's beneficial for all of them. Yes, my main purpose is working on Henry. Yeah. And maybe next time um, he'll come around more. We should talk about time of day, too, because uh, I'm a little earlier today than usual. I don't know if that might make a difference or not. I wonder, and, I, and then when we... It, it has, in many cases, with certain patients, where it's better that I come like late in the afternoon or 
Well, he was he was still kind of in a very post breakfast vibe, and I didn't want him to disappear under the bed. Yeah. Yeah. But he was ensconced on his one of his other beds. I have to check back to see those first two sessions we did that he was really with me. Yeah. What time those were? I think it was later in the afternoon. It was later on in the so afternoon. Maybe, maybe that's something we have to look at. Yeah. Okay. Oh my gosh. Look at her. This is not a contented little face. Oh my goodness me. Look at you. You have nothing to say. Nothing needs to be said. No. Very good. So, so yeah, anything I do on, on any of them, and, and who knows, maybe I'll be able to get to uh, Pixie I and think, or Byron. I think Pixie really showed signs. Yes. And it would have to be where she sleeps. Okay. Let me know when to... Uh... I think we're good. Okay.